Hello, Alex Martin here again from MetroMD. I would like to discuss with you now stem cell therapy for hips. The 21st century has now offered us many options where we traditionally have placed a titanium rod or completely replaced the hip. We now are able to utilize stem cells in a attempt to slow down the progression of the disease that leads to the hip dysplasia. At the present time, we're able, if we can catch the uh, disease process at an early stage, where we see de decrease in the uh, cartilage, destruction of the joint itself uh, at a minimum, we're able then to inject your own stem cells into this space around the hip, restoring the cartilage and preserving the bone so that the bone is not destroyed. This is really our goal. Early intervention, early detection is the key. And that will be a way for many of our generations to come, not to have to go through the hip, hip uh, replacement uh, procedures. Why don't we want to use the traditional procedures? The reason is that the procedures have a certain risk to them. Uh, there's the risk of infection, there's anesthesia, uh, there's a risk of, of blood clots from the legs, as well as uh, all the downtime entailed in the convalescent period post-op. That's a major reason why we would like to have an alternative to the conventional uh, replacement of the hips. How do we do this? Uh, how are we able to have an alternative? It was discovered almost six years ago that we ourselves, adults, have sufficient stem cells in our bone marrow that are going to act just in the same way as embryonic stem cells. They're able, once placed inside the joint, to regenerate cartilage and soft tissue. This is a very exciting discovery because it means that the procedure of stem cells, treatments for the hips, is safe. It's something that uh, we are applying our own body tissues into our own body for regeneration. We are able then to regenerate the cartilage and the soft tissues surrounding the joint, preventing the bone-on-bone -bone destruction, which will trigger the necessity for total hip replacement. So by prevention, we can then continue to, to preserve our hip joints and not have to endure uh, the risks of a full hip replacement surgically. So this is a little insight into what's going on in the 21st century in the treatment of hip disease and hip degenerative disease in particular with stem cells, your own stem cells. Again, this is Dr. Alex Martin. I'd like to welcome you. Give us a call at 323-285-5300. And you may also uh, email us at info, I-N-F-O, at metro, M-D, that's M-E-T-R-O-M-D, dot net. Thank you.